You are my first... and my only... friend. Thank you. Ranko! The enemy. Could it be the Rogueless? You go. You must see Varna. That's Reiko's voice. I wonder if something's happened on Vakanti. Hurry, Yuko. There's no time to waste. That young woman single handedly brought down the Rogueless King. Is it possible that a mere woman now has the sword of Barris in her possession? She must be a giant of some kind. Even with the massive powers at our disposal, it will probably be impossible to defeat her. But by sheer strength or cunning, we must find some way to capture the Sword of Varys! Come.
I am the Red Salamander Zaruga, one of Roglus's twelve generals. Come, warrior Bari, let's engage in combat! Why have you come to the world of reality? I must have your sword. It's you, Reiko. You go. You've got to save the people of Vacanti. You're the only person in the universe who can do it. What do you mean? Where are you? I'm at your side, as always. What happened on Vacanti? Vacanti is now a huge battlefield. The war has turned Vacanti into an inferno, and the people are suffering terribly. Battlefield? After you killed the Rogueless King, the people of Vacanti split into two armies. The army of the Rogueless King, and the army that opposes them. That is how the war started. Why does the Rogueless army want my Sword of Varus so badly? The army opposing Rogueless has managed to bring back Emperor Magus through an opening in the dimensional field. Magus has taken over the anti roglus forces and turned them into his own Magus army. In the wake of the invincible power of the Magus army, the Rogueless army has been losing the war. As a last resort, the Rogueless army is trying to get its hands on your sword of Varus. Who is this Magus? Magus is the rightful heir and successor to the throne of Vacanti. He is also the older brother of the Rogueless king. His older... brother? I don't understand! Reiko! Where are you? You must go to Varna as fast as you can!
Let me pass on this road. I am the Shadow Panther Gillen, one of Roglus's twelve generals. I am all that remains of the Roglus army. In the name of Roglus and his honor, I shall do battle with you. It won't do to die here. Why are you fighting for Magus, and what kind of person is he? That is none of your concern. Give up your sword and return to reality. It's Magus! Magus! Gillen, you are the last general of the Roglus uh... army. You mean the Roglus army has been destroyed, and I am the last warrior? I am giving you a chance to make your own choice. Fight or join my army. You wish to die? Well, Magus, we meet at last. You are the one who killed my younger brother, Rogueless. Have no fear. We shall meet again. Judah! Yuko, Vanidi was attacked by the army of Megas. Our army has been defeated and Vanidi occupied. And Varya? Come, we must go at once.
Are you Varius, warrior? 
Now let's see if it was really you whose power brought down the great Roglus. Why did the armies of Magus attack Roglus? This country is part of the new empire of Magus. We are simply returning this country to its rightful ruler. very strong. But the enemies of Magus will soon be completely destroyed. This all happened because my powers were not strong enough. Yuko, I will now tell you what Vario told us on her deathbed. Yes? Varna has a twin sister. Because it was thought that the existence of two heirs to the throne might cause a civil war, the older of the two girls was sent to the world of reality. Yuko, you are the sister who was sent to the world of reality. You are Varna's twin sister.
Heisen the Ruthless. I am here to avenge my mother. The whole reason this war started was because you killed Roglas. The ways of Roglas were evil. The same goes for Magus. Are you so worried about your daughters that you cannot die in peace? Emperor Megas, do you happen to remember anything about the war? If there was a king who could wield absolute power, the country could be united. That's something even you should know. Is that why you decided to desert Yuko? No, on the contrary, I have continued to protect her with my life. Let's not exaggerate. And what can be done to unite the country? You cannot do it with just force alone. My task is to unite the country by sheer force. When that is completed, I can relinquish power to my successor. Your successor?
to the place of Scarlet Fire Toe. I shall destroy all those who protect Magus. Even though you have succeeded in breaking the Emperor's power, you have not been able to stop the war. The exercise of power alone cannot bring peace.
Your Majesty, grant me the power! This is a test of individual combat for both of you. If I were to help you to win, then it would no longer be a fair fight. Your Majesty! On guard! Huh. Yeah! Now, Magus, it's your turn. How can you possibly fight for a mother who abandoned you? I'm fighting for a mother I loved dearly. To fight is my destiny. Absolute truth is even more powerful than mere physical force. Magus, fighting only brings sadness and pain. Great fighter. An even match always makes for an interesting fight. Magus, if you had fought Toe, you'd have won. Why didn't you do it? Because, Yuko, you and I share the same fate. The same fate? I was the first son born to King Kaiser, the former ruler of Vecanti. But I was assassinated 
in a plot hatched by the retainers of my younger brother, Roglus. In order to stay alive, I received a mechanical body. I resolved to challenge my brother, Roglus. I slowly pieced together the threads of the conspiracy to kill me, only to find that my own father, King Kaiser, was the instigator of the plot. Later, I was banished to another dimension. Magus! It is useless to go on fighting this way. Farewell, Yuko. You who share the same fate as I, I commend the welfare of Vicanti into your hand. Magus. A pitiful warrior. Thank you.